The drug epidemic has uh, really seeped into small communities now, including northeastern and central Pennsylvania. Overdoses happen daily, and some are lucky enough to survive, but others lose their lives. Monroe County's 911 Center recently started compiling its overdose statistics, and the numbers are staggering. Eyewitness News reporter Brianna Strunk joins us live in our Pocono newsroom to break down the numbers for us. Brianna? Well, Candace, today is December 18th. So far this month, 21 overdose-related 911 calls have been placed in Monroe County. Pocono Township police officers respond to about two or three drug overdoses each month. It's a crisis, there's no doubt. In 2015, Pocono Township officers became the first in Monroe County to carry Narcan. The medication can reverse the effects of an opioid overdose. After looking at it harder, I said, mm, I need to be doing this. We need to be carrying this stuff. 911, what is your emergency? Monroe County's control center now compiles overdose statistics. We had somebody go back and research the data from for a three year period. Uh, only because of uh, the, the news media exposure to the, to the situation. What they found is astounding. The statistics suggest this year alone, 444 overdoses have been called into the county. It's very scary, extremely scary. Every time someone calls 911 and says the word overdose, that record is added to the statistics. There are some conditions the numbers don't reflect. County officials don't know if the substance was illegal, if the overdose was intentional, such as a suicide attempt, or if the overdose was a mistake made by a patient or caregiver. We're just going on raw numbers right now. Every morning, the updated information is sent to law enforcement and medical professionals. It gives you a better vision of what exactly is going on around you. In reality, county officials say the actual numbers might be higher or lower. These statistics are just meant to give general information to the first responders who would be responding to these overdose situations. Live in the Pocono Newsroom, Brianna Strunk, Eyewitness News. Incredible. Brianna, thank you. Now, unless the word overdose was stated during a 911 call, the numbers don't include patients diagnosed with an overdose in the emergency room or autopsies that determine overdose as being the cause of death.